again, my name is Gabe Zona. This is the 14th of March, 2019. Just watched a rather interesting video. It's only 6 minutes and 49 seconds in duration. It was put up by Now This Is News, posted on the 14th of September, 2017. It's been around a long time. Title it, Who is Jared Kushner? Question mark. Senior Advisor and Donald Trump's Son-in-Law. Now this. What's written is, how did Jared Kushner become the president's right-hand man? Short answer, a lot of money. Justin Long, Dodgeball Idiocracy, explains the full story of the Kushner's family influence. Helped Jared go from Harvard University to running the Observer to advising the Trump administration on foreign policy. Who is Jared Kushner? He started out a simple rich boy of a New Jersey real estate developer, Charles Kushner, who was the son of immigrants. He was also one of the top Democratic Party donors in the country. He also made large donations to institutions of higher learning, the Harvard. Incidentally, where Jared went to college, he later attended NYU, which coincidentally came coupled with another large donation to the school. His father was later sent to prison and Jared took over the empire. The Kushner company sold $1.8 in real estate before the housing collapse. He started dating Ivanka Trump, another child of real estate greatness. He also got close with Rupert Murdoch, who had a story about his father killed. Hmm. Over the next few years, his media and real estate ventures started floundering. But then his father-in-law decided to run for president. Jared joined the campaign and became an integral part of many important decisions. He would even allegedly listen in on phone calls that Trump was making, but the recipients of the calls wouldn't be made aware. Since Trump's victory, Kushner's previous business dealings started to conveniently flourish. He remains a senior advisor in the Trump White House. You want to read the rest of the article? Like I said, Trump doesn't know how to pick people. Kushner is just another one of those losers that he's put into a rather high position as a senior advisor. Someone needs to ask this kid, what's he advising Trump on? Huh? He also needs to be tested again at the university level. And if he doesn't pass, he needs to lose his degree. That's sort of what I think. He's not alone. A lot of these rich kids that ended up in powerful positions, like Kushner, probably never graduated based on their academic level of ability. What a joke. The whole thing is just a complete joke. Trump's going to go down in history as one of the biggest clowns this country's ever had in the Oval Office. He's not going to run in 2020. I don't even think he'll make it to 2020 as president. Do you? I'll attach the link. Take a look at it. Pass it along to like-minded friends. Repost it in all your social media accounts. You might want to send a copy to Jarrett. Tell him to start studying for his exams. Thanks for listening.